So here we can smash some ice. You can see his footprints in the snow. And he has some snow here, some ice. And you can see all of these ice parts and the gnat grows little by little. And later on in the stage, he'll be even bigger. And here we slide down some ice, grab some more uh, milker. So you see on the top left, my health meter, I had that separate from the ice. So the ice is kind of like my shield. And that it goes into slow-mo right there when somebody shoots a projectile at me. That allows me to, and reminds me to use my right analog stick to evade and jump out of the way of that attack. So you can see the ice is kind of slipped there. He's having trouble walking. And jump down here, so I'm suspecting goblins. And one of them throwing uh, grenades there, so I gotta watch out for those. So in the game we have over 90 minutes of cutscenes, they're full motion capture, full VO. So it's like a Pixar or a DreamWorks type CG movie, so there's a very rich story here. It's very family friendly, so parents and kids can have fun playing together. It's uh, challenging no matter what your skill level. Kids can jump in and have a fun time with it, will adapt to their skill level. But it's also very fun for the people who enjoy Cash Bandicoot and Spyro the Dragon. Those are actually made by Mark Cerny who designed this game. So it's very much at home and, and very nostalgic for people who, who remember those old school games and had fun with them. So here we see Knack is pretty large. So you're going through the same kinds of areas, but now you are you know, twice as large, five times as large. If I get some sun crystals here, get some parts. Watch out for the landmines. I'm going up against some uh, kind of walkers, some tanks. And they're a lot easier, of course, this time, because now it only takes a couple of punches. And before it would be a lot of dodging and evading. And so now that I'm this size, I can also pick up the cars, carry them around, and then once I have an enemy, I can throw it at that enemy and hit it with the car. You can see my leg right now is kind of hurt. It has location specific damage, so it's buzzing there with electricity. Here, pick up a car. So in the game, the knack is basically these relics, these parts imbued with life by the doctor because the goblins have come invaded and they have all these advanced tanks and weapons and you're trying to figure out where they got them from and put a stop to the goblins. Over here we see a sunstone on the left, but there's also some cracks in the building. So this is one of the secret kind of unlockable areas. You come up and it's just a little Easter egg. You get some parts, kill yourself, and grow a little bigger. And so earlier in the game when you're facing these goblins, they're pretty tough. You have to avoid all their axes and everything. And now I can just walk through a few punches and it's pretty, pretty easy here just to walk in the park. Here's another building with a crack in it, so I can come back here and find some parts to build. And I'll show you one of the, the other kinds of super attacks here. A nice attack there. And then the third one is the whirlwind. So you walk around and there's a whirlwind falling in. So now I'm all healed.
So that's basically the gist of the demo. We have a lot of very cool stages, and the full game will be out uh, with the PS4 launch, this holiday. So.